Thank you. Okay. Uh, do you, as you're a Latino woman, okay, do you date black men? I do. <laughs> you I do or them. you don't? I do. Okay. <laughs> That's all I think. <laughs> Why do you prefer to date black men? They love, they love us. I'm telling you, they love us, brother. Like I say, I rock with, we rock with me. You feel me? Oh, it's just the brown skin, the the way that they actually treat women. Remember, you're the one that's on. Uh, I'm sweaty. You just don't know how to do this, right? I can't see myself. Aww. <laughs> So I was saying, I feel like low key Latinas love black guys. I feel like low key they really do. We just like that chocolate. Oh. Yeah, we just like that that dark skin, you know. That um, black guys are really dominant, and like we really we really like that. Mm, okay. Mm. Like you know, if I could come across a successful black man, like that, that's really attractive. Like mm. I'd be all over that. I feel, like, I feel like y'all didn't. I, I thought y'all liked the thugs. So y'all, y'all are into not always. Not always. Like it'd be cool if, like, if, if a guy, if a black guy was like a mix of like, like a thug but successful at the same time. You know what I mean? Like that'd be kind of that'd be kind of hot. Like you don't come across that very often. Yo puedo conseguir alguien mejor que tú. Yo no te necesito. You're too toxic. I can't do this anymore. It's it's over. Okay, just leave me alone. A Spanish woman, they're raised to, to be a wife. But why isn't a black woman raised that way? Most black women are raised to be independent. Remember, remember, let's be real. Most sure. black women are raised to be strong, mm -hmm. tough, independent and don't take no shit because the daddy wasn't shit i raised you alone by myself be a strong black woman why do you so, think that it's such an issue that a lot more black men are dating mm. latino women mm. you know what's funny i know where it started from because you know back then like in the 80s the Spanish community. Wait, y'all put that, answer that in the comments, man. Why are a lot of black people dating Hispanic women now? Like, why are they going for Hispanic women? Y'all put in the comments why you think that is. You feel what I'm saying? Y'all put that in the comments. They didn't want their daughters dating black men. And for a long time, they told their daughter, don't date black men. So when the money came in in the 80s and things got better, you know, black men were able to sway the parents and get the girl. So we kind of like turn into like a trophy thing. Like, yo, I'm dating a mommy or I'm dating a Colombian, like something that's foreign or yeah. exotic. So I kind of feel as though like when even me in high school, if you didn't have no money, the Spanish girls didn't date you. So it's kind of like when you had a Spanish girl, finally, it was a big deal to you. So I kind of feel as though like it comes from the 80s, when you finally, when the black man was getting that money, buying cars, diamonds, all the gold, and the mommy wanted the parts of that shit. And eventually it turned to having like a trophy, like, yo, I got a Dominican or a Colombian or a Brazilian. So that's where it comes from. It's a fascination. And if you peep game, most black girls don't really have a good story about their fathers, which is sad. So, you know, most black women, when they grow up, they're not angry, they're aggressive because they have to be a little more you know, protective over their mm -hmm. hearts and they're aggressive. But meanwhile, the Spanish woman, when they see a black man to them, it's kind of like their trophy. So it's kind of like the black woman, some of them do love us still, but some of us are tired of our shit. But the, the Boricua or the Colombian or Dominican kind of see us as brand new. They don't kind of equate that baggage with not having a father in my life with the black man stigma. To them, we're brand new. Holiday, what do you think? He's saying we're like he black. Is he black though? Cause he look like he might be Dominican. You know what I'm saying? He don't look black, but he might. Well, he might be just light skin, but he look Hispanic. What do I think about? Why do you think why so many <clears throat> black men date Latina women? I think a lot of black men date Latina women because I'm gonna have to agree with Guapo. It's something new. 
it's out of the ordinary. You know what I mean? So when you associate, if I can reverse it, you know what I'm saying? Why black women, we love our black men. At the end of the day, no matter how much I try to dance around it, you still end up with a black man. But women like to date outside our race because we do compartmentalize with the fact that a black man broke our heart. A black man did me dirty. A black man's my baby daddy and he ain't shit. You know what I'm saying? My, my daddy, he a black man, he, he left me or whatever the case may be. And so just referring it back to men, it's the same thing. They want something different. They want something out of the ordinary. It's crazy how one person can do something. You blame a whole race of people. Like, you know what I'm saying? One black, a black person break your heart. You know what? All black people ain't. I'm not going to go date white, uh, a white person. Just like a white person won't do that. White person will do the same. It, it's the character of the individual. Just because this person had this type of character. You can't characterize everybody and put everybody in the same box because you had a bad experience. That's the issue. And that, the same thing with us men too. We we, we we get our heart broken by this type of woman. And then we put every girl in that box and we end up missing out on blessings. You feel what I'm saying? So even if she wasn't Spanish and he's dating the typical girl who doesn't comply or isn't submissive and he ends up getting with a girl who is, he's going to like her more because it's not the ordinary. It's not what he deals with mm -hmm. every day. You but understand I'm going to tell you why I deal with Hispanic women. We're going to have to talk. The reason I deal with Hispanic women is because Hispanic women deal with me. You feel what I'm saying? That's just like that. Every time I went somewhere, Hispanic women was the ones approaching me. So I'm the type of guy I rock with who rock with me. You feel what I'm saying? I was always approached by uh, Hispanic women. They always showed interest. So that's why I'm, I, I date. I, like I say, I rock with who rock with me. I just think men, they're natural hunters. They're naturally out for the hunt. And so why would I go into the jungle and hunt for something that I catch every day? I can go easily like a bear. A bear mm -hmm. can easily go in the water and catch his fish, right? But outside of that, when he goes and does get certain type of meats, he went out of his way to kill that prey. You don't feel any kind of way about it as a black woman? I'm gonna tell you this, as a black woman, um, no. Yes and no. And I'm going to say yes more than no because I feel like this. I'm beautiful. I It does bother me when I meet men who are black who say to me, you're pretty for a black woman. Mm. What does that mean? Or ask me, what do you mix with? When I look in the mirror, I see a brown, I see a brown skin. Now, I ain't going to lie. I see a black woman. I thought I she know. was like Dominican or something. I ain't going to lie. Bro. I, I definitely thought she was Dominican. She looks like she could be Puerto Rican or Dominican, 100%. Mistake, could you even mistake me for anything else but African American? But to the society that we live in, because my eyes slant a little bit or whatever the association is, the straight hair, I don't know what it is. The weave, the, the lace is laying right that day, the curly bundles is extra curly. You associate me with, well, she has to be mixed with something because she's pretty. Because in your in no. your mind, you've been to these countries and you've been these places and all you've experienced is It's not is because beauty. she's pretty. The reason we mistake you because you look like you could be one of them. <laughs> We're not just mistaking you for this because, oh, because we think you're black. Now you look like you could be Dominican or, or Puerto Rican. Not because we think you're pretty. No, you just look like you could be one of those of the women there because you're not in Brooklyn no more and you're not in Jersey no more and you're not in your state anymore. It's something new. So now you meet a black woman who's actually very attractive and, and not to take anything away from our black women, but we subject ourselves to the commentary sometimes. I'm gonna take full responsibility for us and say, you have a choice as a black woman. Either you want to continue to follow the stigma and be a part of that, that stigma, or you can set yourself aside and say, okay, hey, as a black woman, I already know that you already expect me to come in and be loud and ghetto. I'm not going to be that girl. I'm going to be something different. And I think we'll get a different response from our men. Rola, welcome. Thank you. Okay. As, do you, as you're a Latino woman, okay, do you date black men? I do. <laughs> you I do or them. you don't? I do. Okay. <laughs> That's all I think. <laughs> Why do you prefer to date black men? They love they love us, I'm telling you. They love us, brother. Like I say, I rock with who rock with me, you feel me? It's just the brown skin, the the way that they actually treat women is differently than Latino men. They actually well the the black men that I've dated before, they respect you. Um, their background and their way of treating their mom and their family 
is different than Latino man. Latino men don't give a fuck about what they fucking do to you. And if you find out that if they have a side bitch or whatever, you know, I believe the black man that I've dated, they're more respectful. You know, their wife is their wife. Um, well, hold on. It's until- crazy that she talking better than a lot of black women talk about black men. Black men, black dude, they ain't nothing. They this and that. But she's saying they just respect. You know what I'm saying? It's but that's true. A lot of black guys are respect for our great men. You know what I'm saying? But a lot of women, they dealt with the wrong one. Oh, oh, this is a good point right here. This is a good point. A lot of the black men that the average black woman won't even accept because they don't fit in the box. And they're like, oh, they ain't gangster. They ain't hood or whatnot. Those black guys that the black women reject is the black guys that the Hispanics accept. And those are actually good men, and and they have those good experience from those type of men because they they're not they don't go after the drug dealer after the you know what I'm saying they go after the regular guy that the black female's not going after. You feel what I'm saying? They think it's corny. They think it's oh he not exciting enough. You know, I think that's what it is. Touchable, you understand? So for me, it's something different. I love black men so. Hold on, like you're pausing. Hold on for one second. That goes back to what me and just Guapo just said. Her experience with the black man is, is this amazing. I'm yeah. not discrediting our black men. I love y'all. I love y'all brown skin too. I love your dark skin. I love the milk chocolate, the vanilla chocolate. I love it all. Bro. Come on, we filming. Oh, they messed up. Common courtesy. I'm sorry. Um, it just goes back to what Wapo and, and I said, um, her experience. You know, I'm not going to belittle our black men. I love the milk chocolate, the dark chocolate, the brown chocolate, <laughs> all the melanin. But if I have to think about what I think when I see a black man it, off the rip isn't always the most positive. Mm-hmm. So your experience mm-hmm. with a black man is a great one. Yeah. Your experience with the Latino man is a different one. Yeah. If I have to interject and say mm-hmm. my experience with a Latino man, they're more perverted to me. Uh, they're more, they're more, oh, mommy, oh, my God. Oh, my God. Oh, my God, mommy. They're very sexual. They're very open. Mm-hmm. They don't mind saying what the fuck is on their mind. They don't care. They want to lick your pussy in the street and they don't care. They're like, mommy, oh, my God. Lick your shit. Black men are not like that. Black men are not like that. Like, in this, like, it's crazy because, you know, like being a black man or a black woman, like we are so blessed because without us, the world will have no soul. You feel me? And it feels like the world will have, you know, our our music, how we dress, our food. Like we are the source of a lot of trends. So it's like when a black woman sees a black man, she used to all of that. You know, she used to him. You know, having being. She, in, so she's used to him like having. She, 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 she has just as much the, flavor. The, look, look, a black man's strengths. To a black woman, it's normal. Him having rhythm, him being like like her, him being cool with his mother, him being well endowed. So to her, that's normal. But to a Spanish woman, let's face it, having somebody who's tall, being well endowed, loving his mother, you know, loving his grandmother, his whole swag is different. How he dresses, to her, we're different. And she don't care about, you know how, you know, in the shade room, it's always black men this, black men that. But to a mommy, she got into that about black men cheat or black men. To her, you brand new. Mm-hmm. And to a black woman, it comes from her father and the men she's been around, her uncles, and seeing no good black men. So her mind to a black man is like, another, oh, he ain't shit. But to a mommy, she's not thinking that far. She's like, yo, that cute black nigga is fine. So now back to the money. At one point, you couldn't date, uh, you know, Spanish girls. Their mother was very, very hard on it. But the one thing about Spanish mothers, if you get money, they will let their Spanish That's mother date your ass. And get pregnant and move in and yeah. all that. Yeah. Sorry. I don't know. I think it goes back to culture and like society. Because I mean, like you think about it and like this first, like Tyra Banks was the first Sports Illustrated model. And like, you know, that's early 2000s. So it's like, if that's, you know, quote unquote, the standard and like, you know, it's it just hard to, to like kind of break out of that. And so we go from like all these white women, white women, white women, and all in our society. And then, you know, you switch and then, okay, Spanish women, they're kind of like white women. And then it's just like, okay, now black women. All right. 
white woman, white woman, white woman. Uh, it, it just, you know. Light skin, black woman. Even when a girl yeah. has a yeah. white skin, guy, light skin, even black girl. Even when a black girl has no, a black Hold on, hold on. Even when black men date, the whole thing when Chris Brown got beat up for the whole comment of I like I like my girls with good hair and you know and the black women attacked him and said well most of the girls with these good curly black uh, hair grades are light skinned yeah. mm -hmm. so like he said if Tyra Banks is the standard of this slim perfect face nose and because she's the top model then how do I go from that watching it on TV, aspiring to have a woman like that in my house, and then I go to the streets of Manhattan, and that's not the typical black woman walking down the street. Mm -hmm. So now I have to find something associated closely to it, mm -hmm. a white woman who understands a black man. Exactly. So now you don't take the white woman because you're like, damn, society's going to beat me up, so I'm going to go get me a fair-skinned black that's, woman. That's almost true. And No, that is kind of <laughs> true. But I'm going to say this, though. Like, like, besides the, you know, all the superficial things, they in a Spanish woman for like for a black guy with a Spanish girl, the food is different. You know, her whole vibe is different. And like we're all creatures of wanting to like try new things and be a part of like new experiences. And being with a Spanish girl, to me, it feels different. Like your food is totally different than what I eat. The house looks different. Yes. The, yes. the way you dress is different. How you smell is different. Like your hair is different. Now it's not better than a black woman's, but it's different. And people like to like have changed. You think you fall in love you know, easier with a, with a Spanish think, woman easier than you would with a black woman? I mean, my answer to that, I'm gonna give you a real yes answer. No. I'm gonna give you a real answer. I'm gonna give you a real answer. It don't matter her her background as far as my love. Mm -hmm. But I tell you, me being a black man, being with something different, I may be more infatuated with a Spanish girl more than a black girl. Not because she's better than the black girl, but she's just different, you know? Because yeah. my mother was black and my grandmother was black. So I seen all the the, the food, I'm used to it. So getting some new beans and rice, a new chicken, you know, a new a new woman that was raised differently than what I was raised different. Remember, they, a Spanish woman, they're raised to, to be a wife. But why isn't a black woman raised that Most way? black women are raised to be independent. Uh -huh. Remember, remember, let's be real. Say that again? Most black women are raised, are raised to be strong, mm -hmm. tough, Independent and don't take no shit. Cause the daddy wasn't shit. I raised you alone by myself. Be a strong black woman. So they come into the game with their guard up ready. Like I ain't beat for your shit, nigga. I know what's going on. Now a Spanish girl is raised to serve. Yeah. They be cooking for their father at a young age, washing the dishes, washing the table, Back mopping short. all Saturday morning. Mm -hmm. Let's face it, they're raised to serve. Mm -hmm. If one time I had, I swear to God, I'm at. A girl's house having dinner. I got it with my own plate, put it in the garbage, put it in the sink. Her mom spazzed on her in Spanish about da 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 da. Now, in the black woman's house, if I get up with my own plate, she gonna say, "That's a he damn good shit. nigga. He got his own <laughs> shit. I like him, Shirley. He got his own shit." But Maria better get up and get that plate and get it washed <laughs> and show him you are a yeah. wife. They raised their woman to be. Catering. Am I wrong or no? Wait, wait, so what was She's your Spanish dad? though, so let's find out. If, no, is that true? Well, but what was your dad? What was your dad? My dad's black. Your dad's black too? Yeah. He just really young. He's a light <laughs> <laughs> I mean, I am a little something, but but when the cops see me, I'm black. So we go. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going by the cops. All right, we gotta close it up with Lola. Go ahead, Lola. How are you I, raised as a woman? To I was serve raised or be? to serve. See? To serve. Um, how do you oh. feel towards black women? Right. When we date, you're Spanish men. I don't and he choose, because I've, I've, I've seen it, I've dated a Spanish guy with a Dominican girl, the, the girlfriend. How the fuck you dating that Morana? You are offended. Now I was raised with blacks. Okay. So to me, it's not nothing new, you know? To me, I was I was raised in a black community. I was raised in the project, so. Let's say your culture, so though. Black man. But your culture, though. Let's talk about your culture. My not you cult personally, <laughs> but your culture as a Spanish culture. How do you think the majority of the Spanish women feel when they find out that their Spanish man is cheating on them with the black woman? Oh, they hate it. They hate it. It's a competition. But it's like if they why is it a competition? Let, let it's a, a question though. Yeah, it's a competition because they feel like it's something like, oh, you dating a morena, like fuck that bitch, da 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 da. But then the morena is like, oh, fuck you, bitch, da da da. So it's like, it's like on it, you know, it's like something going on. Do you see but, black men and Spanish men as equal? Like, like you don't care if he's black or Spanish, or do you have a preference? No, nah, I have a preference. I'm and sorry. what's your preference? Black. Black. 
Now, but you, you, Puerto Rican, I'm right? Sorry. Yeah, Puerto Rican. I'm not, no, no, I'm not. I'm not trying to be racist. No, I'm not trying to be racist. No, 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 no judgment. Listen, no, all right, listen, no, 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 like, no hold on, hold on. Like my, my, in my perspective as a woman and how Spanish guys been with me and my relationships, it's trash. You understand? Like, mm -hmm. no luck. But how black men been with me, my past relationships, is, they've been good. I've, I've been the bitch. Is it because of the sex? Does sex have anything to do with it? No, nah, not really. It's not the sex. It's about, you know. Do black men fuck you better than Spanish men? <laughs> That sounds like a personal oh, question. No, no. Uh, Let's be honest. This show is for. Do you think that show? Life? That question really is a vague question because you gotta realize sex only lasts thirty minutes. Well, however, however, twenty to thirty minutes. You hear me? So, no, she's talking about the experience, but like how she liked black men. Sex is just a small part of it. Like, you know what I'm saying? It's something. It's much more. I think she's trying to say, but. A, I think that was a really simple-minded question. She was talking about how great black people was, how how great the relationship was, and he come and bring sex. And she didn't say nothing about sex. She, I felt like if she felt like that was something important, she would have spoke about it. But she can't even say she like, well, sex don't even matter. You know, it's just about being good. Now, sex is a good, it's cool. You know what I'm saying? But once you find a person you vibing with and all that, sex is just like the cherry on the top. You know what I'm saying? But the, all the other stuff, character, you know what I'm saying? Who that person is, it weighs so much more, bro. Like, silly. Man, I'm pleased you more sexually. When you have sexually. a connection with someone, it doesn't matter it's what like race yes is. No. It's a yes, yes or, or no, no question. No. It's a yes, yes or no, no question. question. Say yes. Just be honest. Come on. Tom Thicken. Uh -huh. We gotta no, go. No, wait, so go. Yes or no. I just wanna, go. I just go. wanna, cause I know the people are watching, go. the women are watching, they want me to ask this question. I know they do. I feel like they do. So, so, as, you are, Spanish women are so susceptible to wanting to be with our black men, right? But you guys are, don't have that same energy. And I'm not saying my experience, because I'm cool with Spanish mm -hmm. women. But y'all not to have, don't have the same energy towards black women. So I'm going to ask the question of, do you think, not just you as personally, or within mm -hmm. your culture, do you guys honestly feel like you, as a, as a Spanish culture, are better than black women? Yeah. Yes or no? I mean, all right. Don't answer the question, though. Stop. 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 You know what it is? Like, you can't like, generalize everybody. Some Spanish women might think they're better than black women, but you can't say every Spanish woman think they're better than black women. But the culture probably says so. Just like the, uh, I'm not finna say that. We won't keep it going. I'm not finna. Nope. I told, for most, like to me personally, no. To me, no, because I was raised with blacks. But like I said, but, but to, to to other Spanish women, yeah. Not to me, because I was raised with black woman you understand yeah. i was raised like we're in the weird like i have a weed on right now you know like yeah. i was raised with morena's project you know gang or whatever so i was raised like that but the in the culture. community that i'm in and how they feel you know <laughs> oh, that, hey t that was a pretty good conversation tell me what y'all think about that in the comments man hey see you guys next video hey let's get it